Hi again, guys. So on the 12th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me some more baseball cards. Yeah, I wish. So counting down the days to, uh, till the holidays and till possibly Copa. So don't know how that's going to end up, but I want to continue and uh, show my stuff while I can still be searched and while you can still comment. So I want to show you now uh, my 1963 uh, Topps baseball set. And I have a few really nice cards and one, and this is probably the the staple of my my set is the uh, autograph Yogi Berra. Just love this card. I have a autograph Joe Torre. Autograph Moose Scourin. I had gotten this card uh, in a. I won it on eBay in an auction uh, with two other raw cards. And um, I think I won uh, all three of them for $30. And uh, one was a Jim Cott. Um, and that one was actually, I'm sorry, that one was actually graded. It was a, a graded 5.5 Jim Cott. Another um, common and this card. And when I got it, I sent it in for grading because it was pretty sharp. And I got a 7.5. And for a 63 Sandy Koufax, that's pretty nice. These are not easy to come by. These 63s are very, very um, sensitive, you know, condition sensitive. One of my favorites is the Carl Yastrzemski. Just love this card. Got the Mickey Mantle here. One of the tougher cards in the set, the Bob Gibson. Got a Roger Maris. I sent this in for grading and I was shocked at the grade. Um, I, I'm still surprised at it. It's way nicer than a three. I really thought it was gonna get a five. Maybe a 5.5, .5. I, I don't know. Great Boog Pow. Love the trophy cards. <clears throat> it's a Tony Oliva rookie. I don't have the Pete Rose in this set. I just simply won't pay that much for that little four card. It's just, I'm just not a fan of it. <laughs> I'd like to have it for my set, but it's very pricey for what you get. Whitey Ford, Duke Schneider. Got uh, Stan the Man. Really nice Warren Spawn. Richie Ashburn. Got the Bucks Blasters. Billy Williams. This is a great card of Stan the Man and Willie Mays. Got a Dave McNally rookie. A really sharp Louis Apparatio. It's a great card there. ERA leaders. Bobby Shantz. Elroy Face. Norm Cash. Joe Pepitone. Here's a checklist. And before I get into some other great ones, they had these inserts here. And they were the Topps peel-offs. So here's the uh, Mickey Mantle. Sandy Koufax. Stan the Usual. You can see there's two different versions of these. Roberto Clemente. We got a Rob Brooks, Robinson, and a Raw Richie Ashburn. 
And we got my man Willie Stargell's rookie card. Got autographed Dean Chance. Got an autographed Smokey Burgess. Now, Gaylord Perry's rookie card was in 1962 with his own card, and this is unusual. Uh, the following year, they put him in a four card. Got a Clemente. This is a little off grade, and I bought this intentionally. I don't know why, it just spoke to me. Just reminds me, sometimes a, a rough card just reminds me of when I was a kid, you know? Just collecting for the fun of it, not having to put it under a loop and critique every little thing about it. Anyway, that's just me. There's a Don Drysdale. <clears throat> Eddie Matthews. Lou Brock. The two big cards I'm missing from this set are the Hank Aaron and the Willie Mays. And quite frankly, growing up and over the years with all the cards to buy, um, I just don't think they're great looking cards. <laughs> so I just haven't picked them up yet. <clears throat> What's that? Another Richie Ashburn. Bill Mazeroski. Tim McCarver. Got a raw, uh, Joe Torre unsigned. Jim Bunning. Robin Roberts. Love that card. Frank Howard. Got Hoyt Wilhelm. Johnny Padres, the Quail, Bill Verdon, very good defensive center fielder, Whitey Herzog, Cleet Boyer, got, uh, let's see here, a couple Tony Kubaks, Steve Barber, Gil Hodges, Bob Euchre, must be in the front row, Harvey Haddix, Ron Santo, Dick Grote, Minnie Min Minoso. Jim Cott, Kurt Flood, Matty Alou. The Alou brothers were the only brothers when they played for the Giants, I believe. Uh, the All Brothers outfield. Fastballer, Ryan Dern, Don Larson, Jim Fregosi, Cookie Rojas, Choo Choo Coleman, and a card I always liked, Dickie Schofield. What'd they call him, Duck or Ducky? Something like that. Ken Hubbs, he died tragically and suddenly um, after two seasons, I believe two seasons. Yeah, he played 62, 63, and I, I believe he died in the off season. I mentioned on another video in 64, they gave him a in memory card. Elston Howard, Ron Fairley, Jim Gilliam, I got a nice beat up Johnny Pesky from when I was young. 
You know, we used to just throw those all the cards in a in a big box, and however they were, they were. Remember those days? A lot of ways that was better, but got some uh, team cards. These are pretty cool team cards this year. So we'll finish off with the team cards here. The 63 Tops. Hey, once again, thanks for watching.